July 4th, 2019. Imagine a world without America. A call to act. I am Gregory Joey Johnson. I was a defendant in the U.S. Supreme Court case, Texas versus Johnson, that decided that burning the American flag in protest is constitutionally protected speech. I support and endorse this call from the National Revolution Tour and the Revolution Club. On July 4th, 1852, the great anti-slavery fighter Frederick Douglass said, For revolting barbarity and shameless hypocrisy, America reigns without a rival. As we approach July 4th, 2019, the American flag flies over concentration camps on the border, blesses the bombs and planes and troops that have murdered and mangled hundreds of thousands of children. It flies over the pens that mass incarcerate, especially black, Latino, and Native Americans. It's pasted on the derricks that drill into the earth and destroy the environment. It is on the lapels of the legislators who rip from women the right to control their own bodies. It is waved by the shameless fascist Trump who struts as president and plans to bray and grunt a speech that day in Washington, D.C. We echo Frederick Douglass and say, barbarity and hypocrisy? Truer words were never spoken, whether back then, today, or all through U.S. history. And we echo and stand with the leader of the revolution today, Bob Avakian, when he says, if you can conceive of a world without America, without everything America stands for, and everything it does in the world, then you've already taken great strides and begun to get at least a glimpse of a whole new world. If you can envision a world without any imperialism, exploitation, oppression, and the whole philosophy that rationalizes it, a world without division into classes or even different nations, and all the narrow-minded, selfish, outmoded ideas that uphold this, if you can envision all this, then you have the basis for proletarian internationalism. And once you have raised your sights to all this, how could you not feel compelled to take an active part in the world historic struggle to realize it? Why would you want to lower your sights to anything less? This year, we invite you to conceive of a world without America and to fight for that world. This year, on this July 4th, this flag of barbarity and hypocrisy will burn in symbolic places around this country in a bold statement of truth and a clarion call to revolution and the emancipation of all humanity. Be part of this. Spread the word through social media and do your own flag burning on that day where you are. Another world is possible if we dare to fight for it. And now I want to add this. Trump is planning a big fascist rally on July 4th in Washington, D.C. around the theme of making America white again. Xenophobic, jingoistic, and militaristic, all so dangerous to humanity. So listen up, Trump. On July 4th, I'm going to be in the movement to burn the American flag in different places that symbolize the reality of what this flag stands for in a way and in a place that will be quite legal but which will unmistakably challenge and expose your whole fascist regime and agenda.